Hi everyone, this is another edition of Let's Talk, and we host Elsie Hernandez. Marshall Pires. <laughs> My name is Fortune P. Fields. Today's kind of sad. I'm just going to go quick on it. Uh, one of the close friend of ours battle passed away yesterday uh, from a heart attack, from a stroke, and from a heart attack. Um, that's why we couldn't do the show yesterday. Well, I was still upset about it, and you know, it, it's hard because he was such a good friend, and I, you know, he was like mostly close to. Uh, to uh, Father figure, he used to make me laugh all the time. And we used to even talk about comic books, so it's it's really hard to swallow that he's gone, he's not here with us. But at the same time, he wouldn't want us to, you know, cry and be depressed and sad. He wants us to remember the good things and remember, you know, what he said, what you know, what he did, and just remember the good times. And even you know, he used to give us advice and stuff, and both Marshall and. Uh, yeah, it's kind of hard, uh, hard, hard to bear that kind of loss. And, uh, well, just to help out people, I would, I would actually write a note to, uh, uh the family, uh, saying, like, uh, Saying how like uh, sorry I am for their loss. Um, <coughs> I've done that before. Uh, it's kind of like a request, um, and uh, it was uh, it was death of uh, a fellow uh, high school graduate, and. Uh, I was asked to, uh, to uh, write a note and I said, oh yeah, I will. I promised that I would and uh, I did and, and I liked it so much that uh, and uh, the family liked it so much that uh, the note was actually put in the grave. Okay. Anything you want to say for well, <coughs> yes, Luz, um, <coughs> what you call it, Daryl was a close friend of mine, not just mine, but everybody's, and, uh, and he, he asked me if, uh, if I, um, if I could give him the coffee, go to the Muslim store and get him the coffee, and I, and I said I'd be glad to, you know. But now that he's gone, I won't be able to get him the coffee. And I know it's a, I know it's a sad time for everyone. I mean, like you said, Luz, some people go, some people go through sad times. Some, some can't. I mean, you know. It's just, it's just sad, you know, not, not, not for me, but for everyone. Yeah, and another, another co-worker passed away. His name is, um, Joseph Soil. The one that we call, the one that we call Chief. We used to call Chief. Yeah, I mean, he's been out sick. And whatnot, you know. He was out for a year, you know. And uh, you know, and that's it. My condolences. My condolences go out to um, Daryl's family and um, Chief's family. So that's it. That's all. That's all I have to say. Yes, um, my condolences to both uh, Sorrel Joseph's family and uh, Daryl's family. They were both uh, good guys. 
Uh, NASA usually would say to both of them, uh, to the family of, uh, to the family, no, they're not really dead because they'll live forever in the hearts of those who have loved them. Just remember that. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, my condolences to Chief family and Daryl's family. And you know what? We should we should be uh, happy that they're in a better place. They're in heaven. You know, I can see Daryl. You know, in the band, he's talking to Martin Luther King, and, uh, Christopher Lee, drink uh, with his cap and drinking his coffee. You know, that's <laughs> yeah. I can see that. And. We should um we should remember we should remember the good things and you know they would not want us to you know grieve for them forever. You know, we're gonna miss you guys. Um well that's what well not it but that was just what we wanted to say, you know. John Cena or um well, yeah, we'll see you there, we'll see you in heaven. Um, well, we're going to do quickly on the uh, Mortal Kombat. Um, let's see, got the list? Yeah. Oh, cool. Yeah, he got all the lists of the Mortal Kombat characters and stuff. Um, well, we're going to talk about mostly the reboot of the Mortal Kombat franchise. Um, this is going to be way different from the original film. This is going to basically probably take, well, yeah. Um, rumor has it, well, I don't think it's a rumor, rumor has it, they're going to feature Luke Kane. Um, he's going to be played by an Indian uh, martial artist, I've got his name. Um, he does kind of look the part, I mean, not, well, I don't, in the Ocean, people are what, considered Asian, not Asian, but, you know, Asian, but you know how people are, they're so picky, like, oh, he's Chinese, oh, he's Japanese, oh, no, no. Yes, one time someone asked me, are you Chinese? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Who cares, and if he's from an Asian descent, that's all that matters, and if he does play the role, he plays the role. Um, so they're not going to have too many characters in the Mortal Kombat, they're not, they're going to keep it sort of minimal. Unlike the second one, too many cameras. Like it was like it was like a, a three ring three ring circus. Like you know, it was like you know, they, we don't even know who these people are. And like oh, that's from that. That's such and such. That's such and such. And you know, this movie has to be. Um, it could be sick because from here they want to take it more like a dark and gritty kind of way, which is not bad. I mean. You know, it should be serious. I mean, it is kind of a dark story, but it's nothing about light and happy and fluffy. That's it's basically serious. So I'm assuming that, um, yeah. Um, yeah, they're gonna keep. I don't know. I think they're gonna have Goro in the movie as well. Um, so. It, 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 I'm really I'm pretty excited. It's coming out uh, next year, I think in the summer, 2013. And, you know, I'm looking forward to seeing this. Oh, did I ever tell you about the time Rashad wanted uh, Maggie Q to play Sonya Blade? Uh, no, I don't think so. Maggie Q is like, what, Fil Fil Philippine Asian? Tell me, do you think she looks like, do you think she could play, I mean, it's not really the physicality yet. Yeah, part of it is. But her, 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 um, her attitude, her, you know, Sonya Blade is more of a, all she, like, uh, takes no nonsense, she would take no nonsense from people and, uh, like, uh, Johnny Cage, I remember, like, seeing him, like, in, uh, uh, cartoons online, uh, and, uh, different things like that, uh, shows, uh, he was, he, like, uh, thought that she was very hot, and, uh, and she, he always wanted, he wanted to get close to her, and, uh, but she was, like, uh, tough, and, uh, she tried to beat, she tried to fight him, and, uh, I think, uh, yeah, she actually beat him. Mm-hmm. Okay. 
Yeah, um, well, Maggie Q, sort of like that, but she's kind of more of a compassionate person, I can see. Um, she will be a very good Kitana. Very good, because Kitana is, Kitana's an assassin, but at the same time, she cares about me. And, you know, so when she, you know, Wu King falls in love with her, but she kind of doesn't want to be close to, uh, you know, because she's, she's like, what, a hundred something years old? And it's like, you know, basically, um, uh, Wu King's an, uh, mortal. He's mortal. He's human. So, she's not really human-human. I mean, because she's from another realm. So, but she'll be a really good time. Not just physicality, but also the, uh, the, um, what is it called? Um, well, mentality. Really. I guess you can say that, uh, I guess you can say that Liu Kang is more natural and, uh, uh, Kana is, uh, a supernatural kind of being. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. And it's good if they're gonna they have to make this movie right. Make it right. Don't make it too confusing and like whatever. Um I'm just looking forward to this reboot. Um hopefully we get justice to the video games that deserve. Not that the movie previous not like the first movie wasn't good. It was good, but it wasn't considered a masterpiece. It was still a good entertainment movie actually. Um, really, that's pretty much all we have to say about Mortal Kombat. Um, what do you guys want to talk about uh, next week, really? <laughs> I don't know. Do you want to talk about like, more or something else? Something else. Okay, um, well, we'll get, get back to you on that, uh, we'll get back to you and, uh, yeah, well, we'll, we'll, we'll talk about something new in our next week. Until then, this is Alfred Hernandez. Marshall Pires, and please comment. Great, subscribe, whatever. And my name is Fortune P. Fields. This is Let's Talk. Thank you.